Now we'll move next to Jessica Young, and on deck is Angela Larson. Ms. Young, welcome to the committee. Thank you. Good afternoon, Chair Marquardt and committee members. My name is Jessica Young, and I am a policy and advocacy manager at the Medical Alley Association. We are the cross-sector healthcare association in Minnesota that supports and advances Medical Alley's global leadership in health, innovation, and care. Thank you for the opportunity to testify today on House File 991. We want to thank the bill author for the inclusion of $7 million for the ANGEL tax credit. This program is critical in continuing to grow our startup ecosystem. Our association supports tax policy that encourages job growth and continues to elevate Minnesota as a national leader in healthcare innovation. We are concerned, however, that generally this bill inhibits rather than advances Medical Alley's global leadership in health innovation and care. It will put healthcare organizations located here at a disadvantage and will have a negative impact on how our state is viewed for expansions and relocations. To be brief, the significant changes made to both corporate and individual income taxes harm competition, and the other changes in the bill do little to offset this. Additionally, modification to the data center provision is a major concern of our association. A number of prominent Minnesota companies have made investments in data centers with assurance from the state of a 20-year tax exemption. Modifying a tax incentive retroactively sends the wrong message to other companies that are looking to come to Minnesota. I appreciate having the opportunity to share our thoughts on House File 991, and we look forward to ongoing conversations around balancing the state's budget and helping our state recover from the effects of the COVID-19 pandemic. Thank you very much.